Hi guys, so I'm here to tell you a little bit about my natural hair journey. I realized I never really shared my story. So I transitioned from having relaxed hair to having natural hair. It was not an intentional transition initially. It was just I was away at college. I didn't have the money for a hairstylist and I wouldn't trust any of the hairstylists out there because I was always nervous somebody was going to make my hair fall out. So I kind of was playing around with curly hairstyles like straw sets, bantu knots, all of those fun funky things. Just trying to kind of figure out what works for me and my hair. And I realized one day, wow, I look really, really cute with curly hair. And I don't understand why I'm, you know, constantly straightening it. Because it wasn't that it was necessarily my hair was lackluster. But, you know, relaxers do over time damage your hair. And it wasn't as full and bouncy as I liked. So I ended up cutting off all my relaxes after I graduated in 2014. That was a really exciting time. My hair was, it looked the shortest it had ever been. So that was kind of tough to deal with at first because I wasn't used to it. It wasn't that my hair was actually the shortest it had ever been. But with the shrinkage, it just was like, it was literally like up here. And I was just like, oh, what am I going to do with myself? But I said, I'm going to persevere. I loved my curls then. And I still to this day love them. So I did persevere and fast forward two years later to now. I'm really happy with my hair. I'm just in as love with it today as I was when I first went natural. Um, I'm happy with it, but I do feel like I'm kind of in an awkward stage. So I am trying to actively grow out my hair. I'm kind of participating in the Mahogany Curls Grow Hair Growth Challenge. You can check out that video by clicking the link above or to be in the description box. But I just want to grow it out because I feel like, number one, I love to like the length of my hair now but I would love to see how long it could grow just in general and I also feel like sometimes it's not heavy enough to weigh itself down when I do certain hairstyles so I kind of do want to see how it will look with the added length I mean it's pretty long it's the longest it's been in a really long time it's about between my shoulder blades when it is stretched and I do plan to do a length check video pretty soon so keep an eye out for that but it's just not as long as I want it to be so I am constantly working on improving my hair care techniques. I love to hear your hair care techniques. I love to hear more about your natural hair journey. I just really want to interact. You know, the natural hair community is such a beautiful community. We all have so many different hairstyle ideas. We have so many different hair textures. And I just love it all. So please share below in the comments anything that you want to say about your natural hair journey, your natural hairstyles, or your hair care techniques. I love to hear them all and interact with you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you like it and I hope you subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much.